Great teachers make great learning. Great learning is helped by great buildings. Here at Kingston, we've, we've delivered some pretty good buildings in the recent past. We have our fantastic new business school, which has really changed the way that students learn. The new Learning Resource Centre at Knights Park, which has won awards. So we can deliver buildings which really affect education, make learning better, improve the environment for our students and our staff. This presentation is to start to show you the townhouse site, the designs, the ideas, the concepts, how it's going to make us think about students, staff and community. We've chosen the firm of architects and we're finally going to get a really great new building on the townhouse site. It's a wonderful site, a key site in Kingston, a key site in the university. I think this really heralds a fantastic new future for Kingston and for the borough. I am looking forward to see the energy um, in that building. As a student, I'd be excited to go and study in that space. And I think this building embodies the vision that the university has in terms of its future, in terms of the provision that it wants to deliver to all of its future students. This new building is not a faculty building. It's a building which we hope will be the heart of the university something that brings students from all the faculties to it, something that's a learning building and a social building. The university opted for a design competition to select the designers for this building. The competition was coordinated on our behalf by the Royal Institute of British Architects. The practice that we have selected to design the new building for us is a practice called Grafton Architects. Grafton Architects are a Dublin-based practice they were actually shortlisted last year for the UK's biggest architectural prize, the Stirling Prize. So they're a practice who understand how universities work and they also, more importantly, understand how buildings can improve a townscape. This slide demonstrates the most important ideas behind the Grafton design concept. A series of new external spaces. And if you look at the strip that runs between the new building and the existing university building and Penryn Road, you will note that that entire strip has been landscaped. There's a really nice new east-west connecting street between the new building and the existing building. In addition to that, there's going to be a cafe on the ground floor of this building with a terrace onto Penman Road. And that cafe will be there and available for local people to use whenever they want to. This building has permeable edges. There's a colonnade on two sides of this building. And what that means is that it breaks down the scale of the building. There's activity happening within the colonnade and the landscaping rises up through the colonnade. This helps to bring together the life of the town and the life of the building. The roofs of all of these volumes are sedum roofs or green roofs. Looking at this elevation, you will see the long landscape strip to the right with all of the trees, showing the, the new landscaping that's going to be provided in front of the university's main building. The landscaping is actually rising up through the building, so on a number of the floor levels you will see trees on the colonnade at the front. The openness of this elevation was inspired by the university's open door policy and by our desire for civic engagement. This is the space between the existing university building and the new building. It does demonstrate this colonnade that I was talking about and the fact that as you move up through the levels of the building, there's a lot of exciting activity happening. The elevation is active and it's engaged. You never really get lost in this building. You can always look back and see where you've come from. There is a new auditorium in this building. Very importantly, is going to be a resource that will be available for informal use and for civic gatherings. Perhaps a little unusually, you can see into the auditorium from first floor and second floor. The space that is to the front of the slide is student and public facing space. The auditorium is shown in red on this slide and support space is shown in grey, wrapping around the auditorium. The focus of this floor is on dance and performance with recording studios. All the spaces shown in yellow are about dance, performance and recording. 
This floor is predominantly flexible project space. You'll notice that there is a landscaped terrace. It's a terrace onto Penryn Road, so people using the building will be able to step out and enjoy uh, an external landscaped space at that point. This is the first of the library stroke LRC floors and the rest of the building from here on up is focusing on library space. And the library is shown in blue on this drawing with some support space shown in grey. From this level upwards the building is beginning to step back away from Grove Crescent. There's a really nice new south-facing reading garden associated with the library or LRC. That reading garden looks onto the space between the new building and the existing building. There is a landscaped garden that is accessible from the LRC across a bridge over the previous landscaped reading garden. And finally, we will look at the sixth and top floor. There is a reading room right at the top of the building that has access to a reading garden. This new building is not just about the university, its staff, its students and alumni. It's also about the community that we're within. It lies on one of the main roads into Kingston. It's a fantastic site. We want the building to be as open as possible to the community. We've asked the architects as part of their brief to design a building that will bring people in, that will blur the boundaries between the Kingston community and Kingston University. I think they've done a great job in doing that and really look forward to seeing how this university just transforms the way we interact with local people. This building demonstrates Kingston University's commitment to enhancing the learning experience for all of its students, its staff as well as members of the local community now and in the future.